Hello, uh, my name is Vito. Um, for me, money is one of the most important things in the world. I wish to think that money is not the primary needs of my life. However, it's what uh, makes me stay healthy and also what brings happiness to my family. And today, uh, we will ask Hubudians what they actually think about money and what their relationship with money. Very. Because I feel like it's so taboo, especially in Asia. And so if everyone's just more open about it, maybe we'll see some change. Very comfortable. And I think it's a mean for us, which involves to be talked about more because it's essential. Very comfortable. I am very comfortable discussing money. But I think most people are not. I think I'd say I'm fairly comfortable. Yeah, I'd say pretty comfortable, yeah. I'm not suffering, but it's always a bit of a challenge, a little bit of a struggle. I'm, I'm in a very fortunate place where I, I can survive fine if I'm not working all the time. That's all. That's all. Mm -mm. I'm going to say about there, it's got better, definitely better. A few years ago, um, I probably viewed money as something for self-gratification, whereas nowadays I view money as something that you can use to build things. I mean, yeah, build things for business, but also build things that make you happy. Even though it's not like at that level which I would like it to be, that having perspectives to gain it provides me with a positive outlook, definitely. I think money can either be a tool or something that cripples you and drives your life. And I think people tend to accumulate money just for the sake of accumulating it. Like when you get outside in the real world after university, you almost lack a benchmark for success in your life because you're not just getting grades and getting this reinforcement from authority. So people turn to money to to showcase how successful they are, and I think it's kind of like a misappropriated um, use of, of it. Okay, I think no one has a perfect relationship with money, but I've spent a lot of time um, making mine how I want it to be. Probably that until fairly recently, we're shifting more towards here, with the goal of getting towards here. I'm overusing your emojis, so my spending habits today are pretty healthy, but I've just got a bit of debt to clear for my previous unhealthy spending habits. Spend a lot on stupid stuff. I'm really proud of my spending habits. I've been on the road for five years traveling, and I think the only way to do that is by being really smart and making sure that the way I use money is aligned with my primary values, which are freedom and investment in myself. I kind of know what sort of things I should spend money and why. Crazy. Where do I feel? Not quite, not enough, uh, because I am still very dependent on different sources, or not enough sources. I don't feel like I'm free enough, and I still feel like there's a lot of work to be done. And there's no such thing for me as you're financially free, unless you're Bill Gates. Somewhat. Um, I think I'm much more financially free than most people, but I still have a long way to go before I feel as happy with this as I want to. I can make money from my laptop anywhere I am, which is sweet. I can lower my living costs. Very. That's how I've been able to build this nomadic lifestyle. And I'm always looking for more ways to hustle and uh, develop passive income and other multiple income streams in order to feel free and not dependent on one source. I don't know. I think I'm OK, but I'm not rolling in the jacuzzi with massages every day. Reaching that level where my passive income streams uh, surpass my spending, that's when I will be like for myself financially free. Easy money, yes. Money itself doesn't make you happy, at least not directly, but if you didn't have enough, you would definitely be, be suffering like this guy here with a big sweat. <laughs> I think it's, there's been studies where it's even scientifically proven that you need to have a certain amount of money to have uh, the baseline happiness. It's money is just uh, a medium to transfer value. And um, without it, we wouldn't be able to work, to live, to communicate. I think how people choose to use money can make them happy. If you use it as a tool to get where you want to go in life and to use it as a um, facilitation of your lifestyle that you've envisioned, then it can make you happy. Uh, lack of money definitely makes people unhappy. Uh, the bottom line is um, you want to go through your life 
not having this sentence, I can't do that because I can't afford it, pop into your head? Um, I think it helps people to enable them to do what they like doing. And their words and money is definitely immune to it as it frees. It takes away doubts, fears and anything else related to it. If you just think that money is everything, then maybe you're in a different situation. But if you think that how you manage the money effectively, then it can make you happy because you understand how to manage that. No. I think that money can be a source of unhappiness, but I don't think that money can be a source of happiness. No, but it helps. So this, because you're always happier crying in a Lamborghini than on a bike. <laughs>